This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com. Who oh, what's up, people? Dr. Wars is right here, and welcome to another Yu Gi Oh! Packer Ring. Before we start, please check out GeekRetreat.com if you're looking for all the amazing stuff like Pokemon, Yu Gi Oh! Magic the Gathering, Warhammer, Dungeons and Dragons, all that shenanigans, and also get yourself something to eat there. I'll have a milkshake. They are awesome, they're friendly, great people, and a great community. Today, we are going back to a year that we all want to remember, but also forget. 2021, as you guys know, it's the same thing as 2020. You guys know that. Oh, I'm sorry, the camera almost fell on you. I'm very do apologise. The, um, as you guys know, 2020 and 2021, years that a lot of people want to forget or want to remember. It's history now. We're now in 2022. But let's go back to you, girl, for 2021 because they had some amazing cards and of course there is a card in this set that is one I really want and it is a spell card I don't remember what it's called but I know what it looks like so we have three packs first editions there's not a lot of first editions out there now in the world they're only unlimited so these are quite valuable and harder to come by unless you do find them well done to you but anyhow let's stop jibber jabbering and let's go through and as you guys know the each and every single one of these packs contains one Prismatic Secret Rare, two Ultras, two Supers, one Rare, and 12 Common Cards. The card that we want is a Ultra Rare card, but some of the Secrets are actually quite valuable. So let's have a looky. The Commons you may have already seen before in other pack commons that I've done. Ooh, Squire Knight. Oh, Squeak Knight. That's cute. Uh, Dark Templar. Uh, nice. Some Resonator cards. Oh, here we go. Here's our first Super Rare. we got Fiendish... Um, Prior tire, a pro type, pro portrait, portrait. There we go. We have gravity controller, super rare. Ooh, nice ultra rare right there. We got rising, the reptile. We have ourselves um, Vitoral World Zia Gigi for a secret. Ooh, we got Lee in the world, the wind channeler. Nice. Nice, nice, um, start, nice secret rare. And there's our standard na standard rare, Spiral Fusion. And there's our standard commons, as we all know and love. Good for stock fillers, if anybody wants to play cards with just commons. Which I have been doing for many, many years. For actually, no, for at least a decade. Because I don't like damaging the hollows and the rares. Because, as you guys know, everything's made out of money. Money! Now I know a lot of people know that that meme right now is the biggest meme at the moment. Everybody's like using the um, Mr. Krabs money! I'm trying not to use it because I don't like to do the same thing that everybody else does so you get my gist. When I put the um, the super, the ultra, the secret and the rare there so we all know. Actually, there we go. That should do nicely. Next pack. Let's have a look in this next pack. Come on. Let's see if we can get that spell card. Deep Sea. We've got Wind of Mischief. We've got Doyon. Rose Girl. Link Party. AI Shadow. We have Super Heavy Samurai Wagon. Nice. I love the Super Heavy Samurai cards. That's super. We've got he Super Heavy Samurai Swordmaster. Nice. For Ultras. We've got Tree Barrage Neval. Okay, I've never seen that card before. Don't remember what set that was. And then we got Fallen of Albez. That is actually a really, really damn good card. A lot of people want to use that in some tournaments. Um, at the moment, I think it's only limited to one, if I recall. So it's actually really useful. Ah! <laughs> we got it. We got Sky Striker Ace Rose. That is good. I think this is the most hardest card to pull in the set. Not the most valuable one, but is the hardest one to pull. And we just got it. That is awesome. Don't remember how much that one is worth, but I'll take it any day. And then we have ourselves our fish princess. And then our commons as always. Awesome. So yeah, I think the most expensive card at the moment is definitely the Sky Striker Ace card, the Rose. 
I'm 100% sure it is. I know that, like I said, there is the spell card that everybody wants that is used in all tournaments. It's used in everybody's decks. It's super expensive. And you may be thinking, how expensive are you talking? Last one I sold on, last one that got sold on eBay sold for about £40. So you get my gist. But like I said, the prices do differ every single day. It depends on what people want to pay for the card. Final pack. Let's see what we got. We got Genny, the Buzzsaw Shark, AI Love Fusion, Nine Lives Cat, that's awesome. Red Region. We've got Titan Cider or Titan O Cider. We got Infernoble Arms. Super. Oh! The Ash Dragon Ultra Rare. I'll take that. That was really cool. And King Beast Baboros. Oh, alternate artwork. I'll take that any day. And for the secret? Ooh, Virtual World Heim. I think I have this one. I'm not 100% sure, but it does ring some bells and sail pitch. Out of all them cards though, out of them mega Megatins, like I said, Megatins are quite difficult to pull the cards you really want because like I said, they are reprints, but you still kind of complain because you do get some amazing common cards and some amazing hollows either way. I'm not upset, I think my luck is still there and still shining because I want this luck to keep on going all the way up to the Pokemon packs because like I always do, if you get luck in Yu-Gi-Oh, I'm sure you're going to get that luck for Pokemon. And that's how it's going to stick with me. So before we do say goodbye, people, let's see what you pulled today. For normal standard rares, we have these three. Very nice. For the super rares... You guys can pause it anytime you want. For the ultra rares... I think that's one, a quite valuable card, but I'm not 100% sure. And now for our secret rares, 100% sure this is the cheaper one. Of course, that one you have, but that one, I'm 100% sure it is worth. I got hope the future me says it's not, and it is. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed it, I surely did. Make sure you smash the like button, subscribe if you haven't. Like I said, only 9.1% of you are subscribed to the channel. So what are you doing? If you like my content, hit that subscribe button. And also go check out geekretreat.com. They are amazing. They helped me out getting all these products. With that being said, the people I'm to see you guys subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! I like getting these, these are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah! Ah!